What's up, everybody? This is another WFSL throwback. Um, like we're doing another, uh, uh, another video of you know Hazel. I said we was gonna do two over the weekend, so this is the second one. And probably you know from this point on, we're gonna do like one every weekend, all month long to celebrate Hazel and her birthday. So just to make it fun and interesting, so let's play this video and see what happened. This is the Wrestling Fan Speak Out Show A Level Hazel's Way Edition, and here we go. That long vine tied him down one arm and the claw on his neck. It's enough to give that girl the creepers. <laughs> now, on to a few issues that I have. One is with the game. Not Triple H, the game, but Vince, the game. You see, this little guy, bless his little con socks and everything, doesn't like my William Regal. We all know my feelings about my boy, William Regal. He is probably one of the best wrestlers to come out of the UK, along with the British Bulldogs. And for Vince to diss him, you're lucky I didn't jump across the table and get you for that one. On to other things, WrestleManias, they're a week from today. We've got the brother on brother feud, Matt Hardy, Jeff Hardy, which should be great. I'm kind of secretly hoping that Shawn Michaels beats The Undertaker, just so that we can have a break from The Undertaker is so great, undefeated at WrestleMania. <laughs> Didn't get that. Oh, so it would be really cool to see Shawn Michaels in the white outfit again. Um, on to a few other things. We had an interview online today with the fantastic one. He said a few things that were a little bit mean, but his respect for me and my love for him just seems so bad. Hmm, what else happened? John Cena's Photoshop images of Edge and Vicky's baby and the Big Show and Vicky's baby. What can be said? Both of them look like Vicky on a normal day anyway, except for she forgot to shave that day. I mean, let's be honest, if you look closely, Vicky Guerrero does sport a nice nine o'clock shadow that a few men I think would be jealous of. There is a cure for this. It's called a spa. Get a wax and wax it. Which then brings me on to Santino Marella. Now you've got to admit the unibrow is rather fetching, but don't you just want to get a wax strip and wax that thing right off? <laughs> Him being tied up was quite amusing. However, if you've been hogtied, it would be even funnier. Hmm. Let's see what else is there. Oh yeah, some of you know that a certain love of my life, and we're not on about Jeff Hardy. We're not on about Fantastic One. We're not on about MVP, and we're not on about Brian Pence. We're on about my boy, our trail big city jumps to me he is the ecw champion he has the belt to prove it and i challenge anybody out there to take it away from him because not only would you be beaten for the i don't even have that belt anymore <laughs> you would then have me hitting you with the soggy end of your body and robert would jump on you for the final pieces there are lots of new shirts out as well right now me and our trail are going to be sporting some of them at wrestlemania they may not be like the brand brand new ones, like Jeff Hardy has a really cool one out. Um, Big Show's got a couple out. Edge has one out. Everybody just seems to be getting their t-shirts out ready for WrestleMania. More tattoos are popping up than you can imagine. I'm sure that half of these wrestlers aren't injured when they get their tattoos. I think there's a clause in their contract that says, for a six month period, you must be tattooed. And on that note, I'm going back to bed to drink my Jeff Hardy with his finest down to Come here. <laughs> y'all, comment below. Let me know what y'all think of that um, that segment. So, um, just a little bit straight to the point. She just mainly just talks about because um, around this time it was WrestleMania 25. So, and they did, you know, have those matches and things like that. Or, though a few things we didn't, she didn't get what she wanted, but eh, kind of sucks. You know, they had their reasons why they, you know, went one way and another way at the time. But 
digress. But um, as she's in the background singing, I don't know if you can hear her, but yeah. But uh, we are going to do like more videos of these. Uh, and I really miss Hazel runs her mouth. Wish we can do like bring that back to something, but I don't know if she's going to make the time and the she ain't going to make the time for it. So, and plus we don't have, um, we're, we do still do the WFSR radio, radio network, but we just do it here on YouTube. Um, just thought it'd just be like more easier to just do things by video and stuff like that. And yes, I'm still working on trying to make a return of wrestling tonight. So hopefully sooner or later, we'll try to get that back, even if it's for one night only. So it'll be something at least. So I think it'll be pretty cool, but we'll see. Um, anyways, uh, like this video, give it a like. Um, you can also watch this on um, our um, WFSO page on YouTube. Uh, also, I'm trying to think, um, also like and subscribe. I probably said that already. And also, if you want to enter our giveaway, um, all you got to do is subscribe to the channel. If you already subscribed, you're halfway there. And comment on this video and other future videos until we get to a certain amount of subscribers. 175 will get you a Iron Hammer Fungo Bob and a Lorenzo King Bobba Head. One winner will get that. And the other winner that when we get to 200 subscribers, we'll get a Brewer's Mask and T-shirt. So, the, like I said, more you comment, the bigger, better chance you get to win these prizes. And like I said, I already have an idea like who's in the lead right now, but I'm not going to say just looking at the comments and stuff like that. So eh, we'll see. Um, I think that's pretty much it. So thank you all for watching. And to we do one of these videos next week of Hazel all month long, just to celebrate her life and her being here in the U.S. Um, the UK is missing out on a good person. That's what I think. And we're glad, we're glad to have her here in our life. So for that note, until the next video, and y'all have a good one.